It's so random. Halfway through the doing it, she looks at me in the in the in the, in the night like she straight my eyes and she goes, I want you to choke me. And I'm like, oh fuck. How shit am I? She's lost the will to live. She, she doesn't want anybody to know about this. At three o'clock in the morning the other night, there was a tapping on the window. Yeah. Three o'clock in the morning, all of a sudden. Guys love girls with tattoos. As soon as we see a girl with a tattoo, we're like, <laughs> there's someone with really bad short term decision making processes. <laughs> With really bad long-term consequences. <laughs> what I'm saying is you're not going to make me wear a condom, that's what I'm saying. And she had her clip pierced, her fucking gigantic silver ring. It was fucking bizarre. And as we were fucking, you know that trick that magicians do with the big rings? They're not, hey, they're not together, fuck my arm! Then I woke up. I'd fallen to sleep on my house keys. I bought a can of worms. For no other reason than to prove that I actually opened a can of worms. They say a picture's worth a thousand words. That didn't go down very well at school when I had to do a three thousand word essay and I handed in three pictures. I'll be on the internet going now. Movies about ponies that contain no sadness or violence. <laughs> send that off. Why are white people so evil? I'll send that off. Where can I buy second-hand nipples? I'll send that off. Always imagine there's someone at Google going, who is this conundrum? How do we sell to this 12-year-old mixed-race transsexual? I'm doing a gig at the Gold Coast Art Centre and some old duck with a lot of work done was celebrating a birthday in the middle of my show. She goes, yeah, it's my birthday. How old do you think I am? I was like, oh, I don't know. Fuck, happy birthday. I don't know. Your face is clearly young enough to be the daughter of whoever's neck it's sitting on. <laughs> hey, you can't put a Barbie doll head on a Ninja Turtle. <laughs> this end up a pretty turtle. Kids are growing up, man. I've got um, a 30 year old boy and a bitch. Um, no, she's alright. I think she's 27. I don't remember. Shouldn't say that. She could be here. She's a shape shift. I look around. Oh, I fucking love them. You never talk to Jehovah's. I can tell because when they go, oh, Jehovah's Witness, I go, oh, and they go, oh, fuck, the door didn't slam. I've got all the time in the world. I'm chatting. I'm chatting and the change that comes over them, the look on their face, they, they start out fearful and fuck my life and then all of a sudden we're engaging and they're thinking, oh my god, I think I'm getting a convert, I live in Elstowick, I'm a double points win. <laughs> Things are changing though guys, I've got a Fitbit, look at that. Yeah, yeah a Fitbit, yeah, off, off with my partner for my birthday, no birthday cake, no blow job, just a bit bit. And, uh, I mean it does a lot of things but I can't do that. Um, <laughs> And how many steps do you have to do every day? How many steps? 10,000. 10, that's right. And when it hits 10,000, it vibrates. I didn't know that. I thought I was having a fucking heart attack. Because I've been wearing it for three months. Never, never felt that sensation. And you say sugar. And they say, yeah. Two and a half. You know what I do? I just give them two. <laughs> When they finish drinking their tea and they haven't said anything, I say, enjoy your tea. <laughs> yeah. Only two sugars in there. <laughs> Seem to pay some to the facts. Attention nervous, can't relax. I don't touch me, my head's on fire. I can't even buy chicken wire, cause I'm psycho chicken. I have to say, <laughs>
Uh-huh. 